Bioer Life Eco Gradient Thermal Cycler brings you high specifications and rapid, simple touchscreen programming at an extremely affordable price. Together with its small footprint, controlled voltage input and lower power usage screen, it truly is an eco-friendly PCR machine. The neat, compact design has its power input on the reverse next to the on-off switch and a network port that enables up to 30 units to be coupled together and controlled centrally. A software CD is provided to enable the Life Eco to be run through a network or from a PC and for creating and editing PCR protocols. Programming and operation can also be controlled directly from the full colour touchscreen interface using the stylus or manually. The home screen features three simple options Run to select and start an existing PCR protocol New file to create a new method and System to modify the instrument's settings Changing the system parameters is quick and easy with the intuitive interface You can set the language and date and time Depending on individual laboratory lighting and preferences, the screen backlight can be adjusted accordingly. The hot lid controls can be modified here. This number defines the temperature of the block below which the hot lid is switched off. The second temperature is that maintained at the start of a run before the hot lid gets to its target temperature. The audible notification beep can be switched on or off for different conditions as preferred. This function tests touchscreen responsiveness. The USB function enables pre-programmed protocols to be imported from a USB flash drive. Lastly, the melting temperature calculator helps you identify the best annealing temperature to target when optimising for a new sequence. Just enter the code of your target DNA and touch Calculate. Creating a new file is simple. Starting from the pre-programmed standard file, the Life Eco makes it very easy to create your own protocol. Just touch any segment you wish to change and touch again to modify the temperature and time as required. It is also easy to add or delete a segment. To add, simply select the prior segment and touch plus seg. To delete, select the segment and touch delete. For any step, there are additional options available within the OPT menu for simple setup of complex protocols. For touchdown PCR, the extended temperature function easily controls increased or decreased temperature at each cycle. Similarly, the extended time function lets you vary the time at each cycle, making it suitable for long PCR. When applied, these are indicated by the thermometer and clock symbols on the cycle screen. The heating and cooling ramp rate of the Life Eco block can also be controlled. The maximum is 4 Celsius per second, but you may wish to decrease this. Any alteration is indicated by the little running man symbol. The gradient is a useful tool for the optimization of your reaction. Use the sliding scale to define the spread of annealing temperature across each corresponding column of wells with a maximum variation of 30 Celsius. When a gradient is applied, this is indicated by the graphical symbol. The All view presents a summary of the options applied. To input the number of cycles to run, select the first temperature segment to be cycled and touch Go To. Select the final segment to be cycled and enter the number of repeat times. Touch OK. The number of cycles is now displayed. The maximum number of cycles is 99, making it suitable for nested PCR protocols and it is possible to add more than one set of repeat cycles into a program. Once you are happy with your method setup, touch Save Run. Enter a new username or select an existing one. Create a recognisable file name. You can also opt to password protect your file to prevent modification by other users. Touch Save. Up to 250 programs can be saved directly on the machine and an unlimited number externally on a network or PC. When you are ready to run your PCR assay, select Run from the main menu 
and locate your required protocol. Touch Run again. Choose whether you require the set temperatures to apply to the tube or the block. Tube temperature uses an internal calculation to estimate the actual sample temperature in the vial. This is more accurate but takes longer. For robust PCR protocols that need to be run faster, choosing block temperature may be preferable. Enter the volume of your samples. This is very important when using tube control. The hot lid may be turned on or off on this screen and the temperature set between 30 and 110 Celsius. Add the reagents to your PCR plate. We recommend using a fully skirted plate, such as our product LW2216, although others are compatible. We also recommend sealing the plate with adhesive film. Position the plate and close the lid. Turn the seal clockwise all the way until it clicks to ensure the correct pressure is applied. Touch OK. The process starts and you will see the lid temperature start to rise. Once the lid has reached its target temperature, the protocol is initiated. The block is brought to temperature and timing at each step commences. The graphical display highlights the current step at every stage of the protocol and there is an option to switch to a summary detail view. At the top of the screen, you can see what the current segment phase is, current cycle and current block and lid temperatures. With a gradient applied, the grid at the bottom of the screen shows the temperature range across the wells during the gradient segment. You can pause or skip steps at any time. So, as you can see, it is very easy to set up even complex PCR protocols using the Life Eco Thermal Cycler. This instrument is very affordable yet highly functional. It comes with a two-year warranty and a range of service packages are offered by Alpha Laboratories. Find out more about Life Eco at our website.